Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the content that you're watching. Okay, anyways, I mean, let me pull my chair up. Much better. So, today I will be reading some of the most creepiest stories that your parents, well, the, the parents, uh, share that one about what their kids are saying. It could be very creepy. It could be very scary. It will be the scariest thing you will ever gonna see. But think that when I'm gonna read this, it's gonna be so good. So, without further ado, let's get started on this. Okay. So this, I'm at Buzzfeed. <laughs> Going back to this Buzzfeed. So we have 25 parents shared the creepiest thing that the kid has ever said. It's very uncomfortable. So we'll go through some of these, uh, some of the 25. So I'm going to skip some of this stuff, but if you want to see this full article, go to this link. I'll, it'll be in the description below, so you'll, you'll know where to find it. Okay, let's get started with this first one. Oh. Oh, all right. When my husband was deployed, my two-year-old slept in my bed with me. Well, one night, he pointed next to me and whispered that there was a monster. I said, it's okay. Whenever you feel scared, just say a little prayer. So I just started to say one and then put his hand on my mouth to stop me. That was great. Shh. Oh, he doesn't like that. The monster doesn't like your prayers. And oh my God. Oh, oh, no, no. We're not going to start this one. This first story. But this is really, okay, this is from Amy. Your kid has some weird mind all of a sudden. <laughs> a little weird mind of it. When my two year old daughter and I moved into our first home, she once came over and gave me a hug. With her arms really tight around my neck, I pulled away and said, How? Why would you do that? She pointed across from at nothing and said, that man's doing it to that man. Who's doing that to your man? Who is that man doing that to man? Because we don't want to hug, but pull away. You want to push her off. Because if that man is doing it to a man, I mean, by doing it, I mean, I mean okay. Who? Oh. And it could be the ghost is coming after. Okay. I don't know why I want that. I don't know why I wanted to do this, but this is for the content. That's why. For the content. Okay. Next one. One day, the girl I babysat was playing with her dolls, and she ripped the head off of one and put it in a box. Why? I looked inside the box, and there were a whole bunch of stray heads in there. I asked her what she was doing this for, and she by practicing practicing what are you practicing discombobulate their heads and have the head put those on the box okay it's oh my god mm -hmm. yep we're not gonna we're not gonna babysit not gonna babysit this person she has a lot of her mind of something else just go go off all right next one we were at the dinner table when my nephew just stopped Sounded up very serious and made direct eye contact with me saying, I'm going to find you. I'm going to find you. I'm going to find you. Well, I tried to laugh it off, but she, he just kept saying it. He just kept saying, I'm going to find you. I'm going to find you. I mean, that kid can be a murderer. Yeah, that kid can be a murderer. I'm pretty sure of that. My husband is a farmer and late one night, I took my four-year-old and two-year-old to the field to pick him up from work. Well, while we were waiting for him to finish up, my two-year-old asked, Mommy, who is that man outside? I responded, Oh, I don't see a man. Is your candle on the floor? Then my four-year-old piped up and said, He's right outside your door, staring at you. He's scary. He has blood on his face. Oh, God. That's a... <laughs> A calm has been told him to hurry the hell up and we left. But the girls are now five year olds and seven years old. They said that man refused to go to that field. 
man, if he has a blonde in his face, you know what's going to happen. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how much I have goosebumps right now, but and secondly, why do I read this in the middle of the night? I will never ever go there again. Oh my God. Okay, all right. I checked my I checked the night vision day monitor to make sure my two year old daughter was finally asleep since I hadn't heard any noise in the mom. And I saw her standing up in her crib. She then slowly bent all the way over in the way that looked humanly possible, cocked her head and say, Hi. How did she know I was looking at the monitor at the exact moment? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh, mm. <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> oh, God. And she turned her head and say, Hi. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. That's a no, 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 no. That is no. Oh, no. Why is it? I don't know why he turned. Head slow, turn her head slowly. That was no, heck no. Mm, it's not happening. It is definitely not happening. Oh, okay, okay. One day, my son stared at the corner and asked, Why is that man watching us? And why is his head like this? And he yanked his head at a sharp angle, similar to how a hanging victim would look. Needless to say, it freaked me the yep out. And if that man is watching you, and his head is, and he yanked it at the, oh God, that, that, that's like what the hanging with is going to, it could be hanging upside down, it could be hanging like that, like there, oh boy, not really cool with that one, <laughs> I was not prepared for this, it's cold read, guys, I cold read, I never, never seen any of these sort of before, never, okay, um, so what else here? One night when I was coming upstairs at around 1130, I overheard my five-year-old daughter say, what are all of you, why are all of you doing in here? I'm not going to say that I turned around and sat in my front room for a half hour. And I want to risk running to anything. Heard the, heard the say, why, what are you, what are all of you doing in here? And, and then she, and then she said that to whoever. I don't know what I don't I don't know I don't know what they're going to do with do with that kid, but oh it's not very oh it's not that scary because parents are very very aware and they have to protect that kids at all times. These or these stories are parents shared that on Buzzfeed is so oh because I will never sleep again so that's that sucks. Okay, when my daughter was three, I was at home on maternity leave with my son. My daughter started talking about Abigail, whom she said lived in her house. It freaked me out, but I was also intrigued. Okay, so when I was putting her shoes to go, shoes on to go to nursery school, I asked, do you know, do you and Abigail play at nursery? She, and she looked me dead in the eye and said, she doesn't come to nursery. She stays here with you. Oh, gosh. And if you and Abigail, Abigail, I'm sure. Oh, oh, that kind of scares me a lot. <laughs> really, well, I'm a big man, but I'm def that definitely scares me to freak out. Yeah, who is this Abigail you're talking to? And that's uh, that's no good. That is no good. My best friend was cleaning out her dresser drawers when her three-year-old old picked up a picture and said, "Mommy, this was me." When I was grandma, it was a picture of my friend's grandmother. She asked, what? And her daughter replied, you don't remember? I was Grandma Marie. My friend Summer had died a decade before her daughter was a boy. Damn. Okay, let me read this again. My best friend was cleaning out her dresser drawers when her three-year-old picked up a picture and said, Mommy, this was me when I was grandma. It was a picture of my friend's grandmother. She asked, what? And her daughter replied, you don't remember? I was Grandma, Mar Grandma Marie. My friend's grandmother had died a decade before her daughter was born. Oh my God, no, 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 no. I don't, <laughs> so I would, no, no. Oh gosh. And her, I said, yeah, I was Grandma Marie. 
That's a little photo of your of her friend's grand or friend's grandmother, but she died before she. Yeah, my God, but she died before her daughter was born. Her best friend's daughter was born. Oh my God, your kid is. Oh my goodness. Uh, not sure if I'm gonna sleep tonight again. Like I said, I mean, this is just scary. All right. Last three. I'll give you the last three. My friend's sister never spoke a word until she was about five years old. When one night at dinner, she said, said, you're not my real family. My real family died in a fire. Whoa, whoa. Calm down. Kid, just calm down. Why do you say such things? Why are you saying such things? Why have you brought this up to your family? Uh, to your family. Why have you brought that up? Never, never brought that up. Oh man, oh, that's oh, that's awful. All right, my parents told me that when I was little, every night before they left my room, I would say, good night, don't die. Oh my goodness, the last two words. Oh my God, the last two words says good night. Okay, that's good. But don't die is, <laughs> no, no, don't add that. Oh, that. oh, that's that's a wrong, that's a bad choice of words there. Oh God! All right, last one, last one, last one. One day, my two-year-old started talking about someone named Grandma. My mom goes by Mem, and my mother-in-law goes by Nona. I started asking her questions about who Grandma was. My daughter said that she looks like you and Mem, so I thought she might have been seeing my grandma. One day, I asked her if Grandma was here, and she said, in her little sing-song voice, not yet. You have to wait. <laughs> no, thanks. I could. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Someone's ever mentioned about Grandma, and then her daughter said that she looks like her mother, like her mother and her grandma. They're all definitely look the same, because that, I mean, her grandmother, her grandma passed away, right? Remember that. And then she asked if the if grandma was here. She said, not yet. You have to wait. You have to wait. That you had to, it's like, not yet, you have to wait. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh boy. I cannot, I cannot stand with that day. Oh I cannot live with that. <laughs> Jesus. <sighs> okay, that is it for that video oh i've read so I read some things there but if you want to check some of the full versions go to that's in the description below uh i don't think i'm gonna sleep for no for a few for about like a few hours because i don't know what's gonna happen so who knows all right guys goodbye